hello everyone welcome to another interesting tutorial on this youtube channel in today's video i'm going to teach you how to make and attach a ruffle handle to a beaded bag the tutorial on how to make this beaded bag is on this youtube channel so i'm going to link that up there so you go ahead and watch the video if you would be interested in learning how i made this ruffle handle please endeavor to watch the entire video to the end and also like and comment on this video I'm going to be using satin fabric to make the ruffle handle. I'm also going to be needing needle and thread, tailor's chalk, and a pair of scissors to cut. I measured and cut at 31 inches by 3.5 inches. So the length of the fabric is 31 inches and the width of the fabric is 3.5 inches or 3.5 inches. So the next thing I'm going to do is, I'm going to fold this, I'm going to be folding the fabric into two halves like so, but first you want to fold the this tip. So I'm going to fold this tip like so, and then I will stitch. I'll also go over to the other tip, I'll fold, and then I will stitch. So when I'm done, I'll fold the fabric on the wrong side like so. So the right side of the fabric will be facing each other inside. Then I'm going to stitch all the way through to the other end of the fabric like that. Okay, so I used my needle and my thread to make a running stitches on the fabric like that. And uh, this is what I have. So the next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to turn the fabric inside out using my scissors. Now I'll get the beaded bag and my bag handle. So your bag handle could be a beaded handle. Or this type of handle. Most times, this ruffle handle is used for beaded handle. If it is, if the handle is a type that is beaded, okay. But if it is not beaded, with this type, you could also use it. Then there is no specific measurement for the fabric, okay. I just cut out something I know that will give me the type of ruffle I wanted. So feel free to increase the length and the width depending on your bag and so if it is a beaded handle, you already know what to do. Before you attach the handle to the beaded bag, you have to pass the you pass the ruffle through the handle before you go ahead to attach it. So since I'm using this handle, I'm going to open it up and then I'll pass the ruffle to the other side like that. Then I'll get the bag and I'm going to be attaching it. So if it is a beaded handle, once you are done, you know you have to use your beads to attach the handle like that. So this is what the ruffle handle looks like. I will go ahead and cut out another fabric to make the second ruffle handle and when I'm done I'm going to attach it like so and this is the finished look of a ruffle handle. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please endeavor to like and comment on this video. Then if you haven't subscribed to our channel please endeavor to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up.